Good morning, it's Wednesday and it's time for our devotion together. Today we're looking at 2 Corinthians 4, uh, 13 through 5, 1. Uh, this is the same uh, area w- that we were in last week on Wednesday with 2 Corinthians. Uh, just a jump, jumped a few verses. Uh, and still kind of the general... Uh, The general um, uh, conversation is about suffering, about being, about suffering for faith, about, about how important it is to bring Jesus and that others are not going to like that and it may cause trouble and kind of what that means. There's a little bit of that. Well, uh, here's the, here's the text. We have the same faithful spirit as what is written in scripture. I had faith and so I spoke. We also have faith and so we also speak. We do this because we know that the one who raised the Lord Jesus will also raise us with Jesus and he will bring us into his presence along with you. All these things are for your benefit. As grace increases to benefit more and more people, it will cause gratitude to increase, which results in God's glory. So we aren't depressed. But even if our bodies are breaking down on the outside, the person that we are on the inside is being renewed every day. Our temporary minor problems are producing an eternal stockpile of glory for us that is beyond all comparison. We don't focus on the things that can be seen, but on the things that can't be seen. The things that can be seen don't last, but the things that can't be seen are eternal. We know that if the tent that we live in on earth is torn down, we have a building from God. It's a house that isn't handmade, which is eternal and located in heaven. Everlasting God, to you I call. Oh, may I never turn from you and keep me in your grace and truth, my strength and shield till life is through. Unto you I raise my weary soul, In trials I am in your care, in sorrow, torture, fear, and want, still I'm assured that you are there. When I walk through death, I am sustained, I know you'll always be my guide. Eternal God, I cry to you, forever keep me by your side.